guys, it's Lee, and today I'm going to show you how to make these really pretty Mod Podged tissue paper ornaments. It's so easy. All right, so to get started on these ornaments, you're going to need the following. Some glass or plastic ornaments, the kind that you can take the top out of. These came from the Dollar Tree. You get two for a dollar. These, I'm not 100% sure where they came from. Probably the Dollar Tree, but they were upstairs in my stash, so I don't know for sure. You need tissue paper, any kind you like, a pair of scissors, Mod Podge, which you can get at the Dollar Tree. It comes in gloss and matte finish. I just happen to like the gloss finish. You need some foam brushes. I got this pack in my last Dollar Tree haul. And you need some sort of drying rack. I just picked up some floral foam and I have these really long skewers. You don't need anything quite that long, but that's what I had. I could, could cut them down but a little bit, but it doesn't really matter. So I have this as my makeshift drying rack. So the first thing you're going to want to do is take, whoops, take the top off of your ornament. We're actually just gonna be working with one. Then you take whichever tissue paper you're gonna use. I'll start with this one. Next you're gonna take your tissue paper and cut it into different pieces, lots of little pieces, enough to at least cover the ornament. Once you have your pieces cut, you're going to start putting on the Mod Podge. Just spread it around. Take a piece of tissue paper, place it down. More Mod Podge. And just make sure it is down completely. Then move on to your next piece. You just want to make sure you're overlapping the pieces so that you get full coverage. I had to take that last piece off because, shocker, there was a dog hair under it. So let me try again. And then you just keep going until the ornament is completely covered.
Okay, and once you get it covered to your liking, you're just going to put it on your drying rack and let it dry for probably, I don't know, four to six hours. I'm gonna let these go overnight to make sure they're good and dry. I'm gonna do one more with a different pattern. Now I'm gonna let this one dry. Just a little warning, my battery was dying, is dying so I'm going really fast. Take your time and these will turn out so much nicer. But I just wanted to finish it before my battery died. So I'll be back to show you what these look like when they're completely dry. Okay, so I'm back and they are completely dry and I think they turned out so pretty. I love the fact that this one, the white tissue paper made this a little see-through. It is so colorful. I love this. Let me know what you think in the comment section. And here is the one with the darker green printed uh, tissue paper. Again, I did this one really quickly because my battery was about to die, but I still think it turned out adorable. So I'm gonna hang these on the tree and show you what they look like there. Here they are hanging on our Christmas tree. Another thing I didn't think about you could do when the Mod Podge is still wet, sprinkle a little bit of glitter all over it and I bet that would be so pretty because it would be sparkly and just adorable. I also want to let you know that I have a playlist that I will link in the description box below of I think a total, including this, I think I have 12 do-it-yourself ornament videos or tutorials and yeah just go check it out and see if there's something else in there you might like to try if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you're new to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos you can also find me over on instagram twitter pinterest and facebook at lee's home zero five thanks for watching bye